This next story, mate, is one that I feel like you can relate to more than me mm-hmm. because you were a young thug growing up and I was like a really good kid. Yeah, I haven't grown up, if, yeah. if that's what you're trying to say. Yeah. Yeah. Um, there's a mum in the UK who has said that she went away for a little weekend, mm-hmm. nice little quiet weekend. Yeah. She had said to her teenage daughter, you can have a sleepover. That's fine. You can have a couple of friends over. Gets home from mm. the weekend to realize that her daughter has had a house party and completely trashed the joint. And she's posted this video about it. This is a pissed off parent of a child who had a house party while we went away for the weekend. A small gathering, a few girls for a sleepover, who then boys turned up. And now my house is fucking destroyed. <laughs> I have found burn marks where they've gone around with a lighter and a can of deodorant. They put bubbles in the hot tub. My neighbour had bubbles drifting into their window. <laughs> found phones knives, partially cooked eggs. They have egged my house. They set off a fire extinguisher in yes. my home. That shit is not good. Mm. Yes, right. Yes. Well, I can relate to that. Yeah. All of that. Because mm-hmm. it sounds like nearly every house party I went to as a teenager growing up. I don't think I've ever been to any party like it. Well then, okay. Yes. We did have very, very <laughs> different uh, childhoods or adolescent years. Uh-huh. I just expect my kids to do this when I grow up. Like, if I go away for a weekend with my wife, mm. I just fully expect that our kids are going to have a house party. It's karma. Just as karma. Exactly right. I wouldn't have been game enough. Mm. My mum would have. Oh, Trish is scary. Yeah. Trish can be really scary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My parents are scary too. I was just a much <laughs> yeah. worse child than you were, mates. Uh.